All right, guys, I wanted to give you a quick demo of how your time circuits are going to work. So I've already powered it up, uh, but I'll show you again. I've got a long USB cable here with power plug goes in. It's just a micro USB. So you see how wide open this back is. So you can actually run your wires through the box however you need to. Um, so for power, it'll just actually plug straight in and you'll actually see it blink here through a number sequence just a countdown let you know this is boot up sequence all right so now we're ready to go um, stays blank until codes start being entered uh, the numbers obviously work and if you fail it So it's about a five second countdown for you to fail. You have to enter the correct number, um, which I believe I currently have set up. That's just one, two, three, four, five, six, twice. All right. And you hear the success audio play. Now when this happens also, I've got two wires coming out right here. Both are just open voltage to two relays down in here. And what this means is whatever voltage you want to bring into these, be it for your lights, your 12 volt lights, 110, um, you've got three wires for each one. One is a common, one is a normally open, and one is a normally closed that ties into the relays. And I can go into more detail of what that entails if you need it, but you'll most likely be using the normally open to the common um, terminals uh, so that when the relays turn on, your maglock will open and your lights will come on. Uh, this here is the audio module with an SD card in it. So if you ever want to change the audio in the future, you can just pop that SD card out and kind of look at how the files are formatted in there and, you know, change your audio if you want. Um, the other thing is actual programming. Uh, we set up the admin code uh, that you supplied me. Um, so if I want to reset this during game reset, all I have to do is come in and hit the pound button and it'll actually reset it, turn the relays back off. Um, and then if any time, say I'm entering a code and I want to restart cause I'm not sure where I ended up or anything like that, I can hit the pound button. Now your customers probably won't know this, but that way you at least know how to reset the prop just by hitting pound button. All right. So on admin entry. I believe it was 0812, so August 12th, 2005, um, at noon, so 1200. Zero, zero. And you'll see another countdown, 10, and then some audio that says, please enter phone number. So now you're going to enter the new code. Uh, let's make it backwards, 987654, twice. And you'll hear now it's not actually the tones, it's actually telling you the number. This way you know you're in admin mode. New number saved. It'll reset, do a quick little fail. All right, and now if we wanted to reset, but it's reset itself, we're ready to go for the actual game. So if I enter now, 9876542 twice. Relays clicked in. We're successful. So I hope you guys like it. Uh, if you need anything uh, changed or anything like that, let me know. I'm hoping to get this shipped out to you tomorrow. Um, and I'm still thinking about your wild west uh themed poker prop and i think i've got a couple of ideas on that but i want to hash out the rest of the night and uh let me know if i can help with anything else thanks guys